Hi guys, привіт не з України. Thank you so much for subscribing and watching videos of Shashank. My name is Bogdan and today I would like to tell you about current situation with the war in Ukraine and how mass media shows it. The situation with the war in Ukraine is still hard. As you may be heard, Russia took its troops back from Kyiv and Chernihiv. But they will not come home. They will be moved to another district of Ukraine, probably Donetsk and Luhansk, to continue war actions there, to continue to destroy and kill. A lot of cities and villages of Ukraine were destroyed. Even such big city as Mariupol, which had a population of 400,000 of people, was completely destroyed as another cities and villages. A lot of people were killed, a lot of women were raped, a lot of children were killed, and a lot of children are left without parents. Have you seen what's going on on Bucha? A lot of naked, killed people simply lie on the streets. It's even seen from the space. President of Russia, Putin, wants to end the war before 9th of May, because on 9th of May it's a victory against fascists in Second World War. Unfortunately, they forgot that they are fascists now. How mass media show the situation in Ukraine? Firstly, they show that Russia took its troop back from Kyiv in Chernihiv. But it doesn't mean that the war is over or it will be going to be over. It means that they will be moved to another district of Ukraine, as I said. Secondly, uh, mass media doesn't show all the violence of Russian troops. Violence of Russian troops has no limits. They kill Ukrainian people, they kill everybody who speaks Ukrainian, they steal everything that they see. Water machines, fridges, even toilets, because their families ask to do that. So, what you can do for us, for all of Ukraine? I know that a lot of you are very stressed and anxious, because for a lot of you guys, Ukraine is a second home. But how it will help our country? It will not help. It will not help even you when you are stressed and anxious. It will only hurt you. What you can do? You can hope and pray for the best for our country. You can donate money in different sources. And of course you can spread in your social networks pages about real situation in Ukraine, about war crimes in Ukraine made by Russian troops. What Russia do to Ukraine, it's a genocide. So I am pretty sure that soon Ukraine will win. We will win, of course, there is no other option. And I understand that some of you will change university to another country. But still I hope that most of you will stay loyal to Ukraine and you will be studying in Ukraine and you will come back there as soon as possible. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you Shashank for allowing me to record this video. And victory is ours. Peace will come. Slava Ukraini. Se bude Ukraina. And thank you so much for your intention. All the best.